In this presentation, we're going to review the Remote Excel product feature, which comes free when you purchase opcxcel.net. With the Remote Excel product feature, we can host data from any PC with an available internet connection, and then consume that data on unlimited number of client PCs with Microsoft Excel. And in fact, any of the 15 product features of the complete SCADA suite, opcsystems.net, would be able to utilize the data coming from Microsoft Excel. This would include trending, alarming, HMI for both iPhone and Windows applications. We can even generate alarms and alarm notifications based upon data from Microsoft Excel, and then log those values to SQL Server, Oracle, Access, and MySQL. In this presentation, I'm going to show how to host data from your own PC with a standard internet connection. Let's see how we can set up the hosting for the remote Excel product feature. After you install opcsystems.net, which you can download from the website opcsystems.com, go to the program group opcsystems.net and select Configure OPC Systems. We'll select Configure Tags, and we'll host this data in two ways. One from my own PC locally here, and then also I'll set up another tag on a fixed IP address system that's available with an internet connection. And we'll see that with a standard internet connection, we'll be able to host data from both systems. On my local system, I'll create a tag called My Local Excel Value. Now I'm going to create another tag on a system that's available on the internet connection at opcsystemserver.com. I'll first need to log into that system because it does have security. On this system, I'll use a tag name called My Shared Excel Value. We would then save this tag configuration and under configure options set it to automatically load when each service starts. And now we're ready to use Microsoft Excel to host data from this PC to both services. If you're using Microsoft Excel 2010, make sure you download the hotfix for Microsoft Excel 2010. You can find the download for that in the OPC Excel wizard application, which we use to browse for tags. First, let's host some data to the local service. There we have the new tag called My Local Excel Value. I'll select the value property and I'll enable the write feature. And the data source for this value is going to be A1. So any value that's in the cell A1 will automatically be written to My Excel Value. I'll then copy that to the clipboard and paste that into Microsoft Excel. I'll then put in the value 123 and I'll see that in that tag I'll have the value 123. And just so that we can see that, I'll bring the feedback into this local Excel workbook so we can see what the current value is of that tag. Now let's write to the remote OPC system service at www.opcsystemserver.com. And this could be an IP address or registered domain name that's available on the Internet that has the OPC system service running on it. There I see the tag name My Shared Excel Value. I'll select the right option and I'll choose the data source of A2. And I'll also read that value back into my local Excel workbook. There we can see that anywhere this Excel workbook is running, it'll be able to write to the opcsystemserver.com and then also be used as a client to read that back. Now I'm going to show you a third way to host the data. We're going to host the original tag on my local service and make it available over the internet even though it has a local standard internet connection right here. To do that we'll use the live data cloud feature and we'll set that up using the configure OPC systems application. We'll go to configure live data cloud, select the local service, Enable hosting, and we'll enable hosting at opcsystemserver.com as the server name, and the PC name I'll use my PC. And I'll add that to my local live data cloud configuration. I'll save that to a file, and then under configure options, I'll automatically load this configuration file when my PC starts. Now when we go back to the OPC Excel wizard and we select the opcsystemserver.com, we see that we now have a new live data cloud PC available. I'll select that. And what I'm doing is I'm routing back to my own PC, and this could be from any client PC with a standard internet connection. I'll select the right function, and I'll use the data source A1. 
I'm going to replace the existing calculation that we have from the local service and instead write that over the internet. Now if I change the value in A1, when I hit the enter key, I'm actually writing the value that's live on my own PC through the internet back to my own PC again. So you can see that you can mix values from OPC servers, OPC clients, Visual Studio applications, Microsoft Excel, databases like SQL Server, Oracle, Access, and MySQL, and also controllers like PLCs and DCS systems. They can all be data sources for the remote Excel feature. And then from the client perspective, Microsoft Excel can be both a, can both read and write from anywhere in the world. And you can see you can host data in multiple ways, either from your own PC or from a remote PC with a fixed IP address or registered domain name. With the Live Data Cloud feature, you do not need a fixed IP address on your own PC, you just need a standard internet connection. For more information on the Remote Excel feature, visit CompleteSCADA.com and you can review information on all 15 product features that are compatible with Remote Excel feature. To try this feature yourself, select the Downloads button at the top of the page. And to contact us, select the contact button at the top of the page.